Hi, I'm Pete Whaler, the Pneumatic Product Specialist here at the RG Group, and today I'd like to reintroduce you to the Moduflex line of valves available from Parker. And what I mean by reintroduce is there are some new connectivity options that are available on the Moduflex series of valves um, that were previously unavailable. So what you see is the 20 pin D sub option that has been available from Parker for years. Um, they also have a 25 pin D sub that's been out there for a long time. But what is new with the P2M network nodes that are now available, available from Parker is you can get industrial ethernet connectivity right on board. So uh, it's just a different module that sets right up onto the front uh, head of the valve and the different industrial ethernet protocols that are available are ethernet IP, Profinet, Modbus, T TCP, and PowerLink. You can also get an IO Link Class A and Class B modules that come inherently with diagnostics. And also, they have field bus options with DeviceNet, Profinet, CanOpen, ASI, and Interbus S. So that's what's new on the Moduflex line. So again, it's a really easy way to get a variety of connectivity options right onto the head of the valve that will help you save a lot of time and money on installation and installing and connecting this to your industrial network. Now, for those of you not familiar with the Moduflex valves, I'd like to just point out a couple of kind of key features, some things that set this apart from other things on the market. So it's available in two different sizes. There's a size one and a size two that are available uh, on this valve series. And you can get flows all the way up to 0.8 CV, which is quite a bit from a very small valve package that you see here. And you can get these in a variety of shapes and sizes that are available. Um, so to change out these, these connectors, all you do is just a simple straight screwdriver, pops that loose, the fitting will pop out, and you can replace it with a different size or shape easily, and then just relock it into place. And as you can see, it stays put. It's available in a variety of metric and imperial sizes, um, all the way from four millimeter tubing up to a 12 millimeter OD size, and also with uh, an integrated muffler like you see here. Uh, it, comes in three different varieties. There is an S series, which is an individually sub-base valve. So what you see here, so this guy can set all by itself. <clears throat> As you can see on the bottom, you can actually DIN rail mount these, which makes them really nice. And this is just uh, an individual standalone valve. So again, it does not need to be um, on a manifold as you see. So if you've just got, you know, maybe one little spot that you need to put a pneumatic valve, uh, something small, compact, really nice little light valve that can sit there all by itself. And it does have a spot for an individual wire. So again, you just make one little simple connection and you're individually wired back to your PLC. Um, the other one, uh, the other series is a T-series. Um, that T-series is a lot like this one. But instead of having the collective wiring uh, head that's on it, every single valve would have this same connector that you see here. So again, uh, nice way to manifold valves, but again, not doing collective wiring. And then if you go to the V-series, which, uh, which is sampled here, the V-series has the collective wiring. So again, easy way to do collective wiring, one wire right back to your PLC. And we talked about you can do that a variety of different D sub mounts, um, all the way up to your different uh, Ethernet protocols, IO link, and field bus. The Moduflex valve series comes with one watt, 24 volt DC coils, and is up to an IP65 rating. And uh, is this valve is very easy to change out the variety of valves that are on here. Um, so again, this is just a simple uh, torque screwdriver. Just insert the screwdriver in here that will loosen the valve. You can take it apart, replace it, put it back together. So you can see it's a, it's a, collect, it's a collected screw. That way um, there's nothing to fall out. Tailpiece goes back on here as a trim and screws back in. So the next time you're in the market for a small, compact, cost-effective valve solution, please get a hold of us here at the RG Group, and we will be more than happy to show you all of the features that are available from the Moduflex 
uh, the Modiflex valve series, as well as talk about the different connectivity options that might be right for you.